What's up, guys? This is Willow of Ritsky75 here. We're joined by Sam or Sam FX3, and we're joined by our new guy. Well, actually, he's not a new guy, he's been with us forever. You guys never met him, but it is. Uh, Killer Gorilla or, or Jack here. Right, okay, guys, well, yeah. that's the first time Jack. you've ever heard Jack speak. But, uh, <laughs> he won't be speaking in. Actually, he was in a very early video on my channel, but, um. Or on your Sam FX3, yeah. And, uh, well, guys, let's start. First of all, welcome back to. The Halo 4 Discussion and Rumours Episode 5! That's right. And uh, first of all, let, I want to yes. do a little, little apology on uh, why it hasn't been released until like now. It's because <laughs> a list of excuses has been flying our way. Yeah, it's pretty much like we haven't done our homework and we're grasping every little last straw. To try and apologise to you guys, basically we're going to try and blame it on Robin. But um, that won't work. It was Will's fault. No, yeah, sorry, sorry guys. The fact that I'm uh, celebrating my birthday, which was yesterday. Okay, it was Will's fault on his birthday, it was Jack's fault on Monday, it was my fault over the weekend. It was Robin's fault generally. Anyway, you guys got it now, so you know, be happy, don't dwell in the past. So we should probably get cracking. Okay, right. Yeah, and eat pot noodles. <laughs> oh, yeah, pot noodles. Okay, Jack's right. obsessed with pot noodles. Okay, right. Can we go now, please? Let's just do a little start. First of all, Let's start off with a little summary on what we're going to be talking about this week. We're going to yeah, call... summary song for the win. Now, I've heard about these two... Jack, stop posting about pot noodles! <laughs> we're going to be uh, talking about the, uh, <laughs> the Crawler and the Watcher, which are supposed to be two new enemies in uh, Halo 4. Well, can I just say, before you talk about the Crawler and the Watcher, if any of you guys listening are feeling particularly charitable, then could you please send Jack some pot noodles? That would be very nice of you. And this is uh, this is uh, how I uh, how I'm business at roosterteeth.com. Oh uh, yeah, okay, that'll do. <laughs> okay, right. So uh, yeah, let's. So that's the crawler and watcher, which are two enemies. I might the have. Crawler and the watcher. I'll have screenshots of those up before we're talking about them. And the uh, we talked about this a bit last week briefly about the uh, the Xbox magazine that a uh, gun must be for carrying it has now been confirmed, but I won't give it yes. a name yet. And we're also the main reason we've got Jack here is because we're gonna be talking quite a lot about Forge as well. Because yes, it Forge. still hasn't. Jack been... is our Forge man. Yeah. Yes, I am. It still hasn't actually <laughs> been confirmed. That hasn't been confirmed yet, so we're not sure about that. Oh, cheers. Yeah. No, is it not? I mean, Forge hasn't been confirmed. It's not our fault. <laughs> <laughs> okay, right. So, shall we get started? Yeah. Okay. Oh, Fred's online. <laughs> oh. oh dear. Okay. Go just... troll nuclear Hello Five. Yep. Uh, this is a. Uh, Anywho. This is, this is Jeff at RoosterTeeth.com. <sighs> okay. All right. So let's start. Let's stop making Rooster Teeth jokes. Should we start off with the crawler and watcher? I think we should. Good. I think, I think New I'm... enemies are pretty interesting, actually. Yeah, I, I'm. I'm. On, I'm just actually looking at them like right now, like literally into Google. I love Google. Don't we all? But the thing is, new enemies, we talked a lot about this last um, episode. Was it last episode or was it three? I'm fairly sure it was last episode. So I don't think I was in three. We talked about new enemies an awful lot. And now we've yeah, actually got yeah. some stuff confirmed. Is this confirmed, Will? Um, yes, the call on watcher are confirmed. I've got quite a lot of screenshots. Oh, okay. Uh, here. Damn, we sort of, you know, screwed up our video order, didn't we? <laughs> we have granted it. But, uh,. Yeah, there are anyway. quite a few pictures of uh, these. You'll be able to see these now, and they look like bugs, some kind of messed up bugs of some kind. Have you seen these? They remind me of the flood. They do kind Slightly. of. Slightly. And then they might be like some kind of advanced flood. We said last week about uh, well, Sam was going on about this about uh, how they might be using laser technology. Yeah, laser technology. Well, they do kind of. Well, one of them looks like a little bee. Which looks quite scary and it's like a little laser thing. So. Yeah, exactly, he's got a little laser thing. So I reckon he's gonna be epic. Yeah, you can send Jack some honey as well. Yeah, and you can send and you can send him honey at um Joel at roosterteeth.com. <laughs> so uh yeah, I'm well, just having well, a Well those jokes weren't funny in episode one, but anyway. No no, I'm just gonna keep going. So yeah, Crawler and the Watcher. Confirmed enemies, that's um it's a bit more info. Do you reckon they'll be in Firefight? That's a good point. 
Um, I'm not actually sure. Yeah, I'm uh, just looking on the Halo 4, like, you know, website. That's how cool I am. Ooh, yeah, that's time. that's what you do in your spare time, because you get back, you get you're banging every day. I'm banging seven grand rocks. <sighs> yeah. What? Pardon? Haven't oh, you dear. seen the winning Q, song? Q hate me. Yeah. Anyway. Uh, I don't. I don't care if it's Charlie Sheen. <laughs> Charlie Sheen. Anyway. Uh, yeah. They're actually not on the um, the Halo 4 website. The I might just go to the 343 website as well. Mm, maybe. Because uh, there'll be a load of stuff there. So, we're on the watcher. Yeah, they, they look pretty insane, to be honest. They look pretty good for, you know, enemies. I, I'm liking the, the design, the concept. I wonder and if you're... I think so far, 343 actually doing a pretty good job. Yeah, I, I, I think... Because they... I think they've been getting quite a bit of, like, hate, kind of. The fact that they've been... They have. Stuff, like, they've... I think it's because everyone saw about just Bungie leaving, and I know I felt a bit like that. Beforehand, yeah. but you know, I, I'm willing to give three, four, three a chance. So am I. Yep. In fact, I think I, I'm really looking. I said about this. The thing I'm most looking forward to is a uh, three, four, three's interpretation on it, because as we we should know, uh, three, four, three only got a, a partially quite a small uh, say in uh, what goes on in Halo. But now they've got the whole thing, and from what we've already seen, even though it's quite uh, far away, its release date, it still looks pretty different, and it looks quite cool as well. So. I think people should. Judge yeah, it does. It. I think people should judge it when it comes out. Exactly. You can't judge it by all this premeditated crap that we're spewing at you at the speed of light. Or in fact, the internet generally, not just us. Uh, spewing. Fucking man, how do you? Right, we're, we're not going to sing. This is not a singing video. Yeah. What the hell is it? Although Will has a brilliant soprano voice. But I'm thinking it's about time to move on. Uh, yeah, I think it is as well. We have loads of pictures, we'll have information up as well. A load of stuff. So that'll be pretty cool as well. And hopefully Jack will give more interpretation than we thought. Okay, stop this pot noodle spamming, Jack. <laughs> Please. I like the pot noodles. <laughs> I know you like pot noodles. So does everyone watching. Now, guys... You've said it like eight times. We did briefly <laughs> go over this in uh, the last game. It was the, uh, oh, what was previous. it? It was the ra railgun, wasn't it? The railgun. Yeah. Yes, the railgun, indeed. No idea what it's going to be like oh, right. at the moment. I don't know. What is a railgun? I mean, it has a definition, doesn't it? Kind of. Like um, it's an anti-material. It's designed to sort of go through walls, etc. All right. Okay. So uh, they have. There's some film with Arnold Schwarzenegger in it where he has a railgun. And basically, they're just very high penetration, long distance rifles. No, I think that's going to be pretty interesting because that might. I don't know. Do you think it'll be oh, single matchmaking? shot? Matchmaking? Uh... Oh, definitely. You can't have that, like, freaking semi. It would be overpowered. I yeah. think they might not put their matchmaking. I think it might be an uh, ordnance weapon. Like, yeah. A really maybe. overpowered weapon. And you can't get it in the loadouts. And on some maps, you can't find it. Oh, much. definitely. I think it's going to be a pretty awesome thing. I reckon it'll be a bit like the Gorse yeah. Warthog. I mean, you can forge it, but you won't be able to yeah. use it in multiplayer. Yeah, pretty much. Or until the update. Yeah. Although, there is a map in the Combat Evolved DLC that does have a Gorse Warthog in it. And it's so <laughs> majorly overpowered towards that team. The other team get a Banshee, but it's nothing. Yeah. Well, guys, I've just thought of another <laughs> My topic. Got a... uh, guys, uh, I've just thought of another topic we can go over, but I'll tell you that at the end of the video. It's not really to do with Halo 4, but it's to do with Halo. So, yeah. Right, right. so that's the railgun. Uh, so we think it's going to be an armor piercing yes. weapon, which is going to be an ordnance. Um, Including think... cover piercing. I think pierce cover. Uh, yeah, I, I really hope it does. Depending on the thickness of the cover. Uh, yeah. Maybe, but then they might have to implement a it was not like cold cold system. But... Yeah, cold system. Any gun can fire from any surface and just kill anyone. Yeah. Well, that's not technically true, but it really is true-ish. You can just spam through the walls. You know the dome. You yeah, can you can just spam. spam and just use the PP90, and you know. I was playing that with the PP90. Anywho. Yep. Yeah. So, PP90. Would you 90. say that is it for the railgun? Uh, yeah, but the rail the railgun is confirmed. Well, at least you know that gun's confirmed. I'm sure it is. Um. Confirmed. Yeah. 
so that should be fun. I've also got I'll have some pictures up as well of the railgun. It is a electromagnetic projectile weapon, apparently. There you are. Projectile. It goes through stuff. So it's definitely a projectile. Anywho. Ooh. Ooh. Let's move on. Yeah, apparently. Lee. Uh, it's going to be similar to the, uh, well, what's it called? The Mac? The Mac gun? You know, the big. Oh, a smaller Mac cannon. Yeah, because, you know, that's kind of penetration weapon, isn't it? An ordnance. Uh, penetration. Yeah. <laughs> that's what she said. Uh, yeah, it is, because you use it to take out the, um, Corvette, don't you? The end of reach. No, guys. And, of course, they're mounted on three as well. That's it for the railgun, and I think we should, uh, swiftly move in to the forge topic. Yes. Move in, that's what you said. Oh yes, Jack's favourite. Yeah. So Jack, how will you introduce us? Um, okay. Right. Um, I'm hoping that the forge in Halo 4 is going to be a bit like the forge in, um, Reach. But... Well, possibly... I'm guessing that you'll actually want it to be there, considering they haven't actually confirmed it yet. Yeah, yeah, I <laughs> guess so. But I, it has been in Halo 3, it's been in Halo Reach, so I don't see why yeah. you'd get rid of it. I know, they, well, I mean, they're not going to take it out. If they do, then, well, I'm fairly sure Jack won't buy it. Nope. Jack, would you say Forge is your favourite part of Halo? I think it probably is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Easily. You're definitely our map guy. Uh, you make all of our cinema maps. I'm not sure good I custom think, game map. I kind of think Campaign is one of the best uh, game types, just purely because it's so amazing. Yeah, yeah, it's it's great. The story in Halo is always great. But so, Jack, um, what would you like to see from the new Forge? Um, well, I was thinking possibly three four three could um, improve the engine to allow more objects and like more money, so you can make more. So yeah, more money, so you can have more stuff. Yeah, pretty much. And yeah. like in that Halo. Would be awesome. And like in Halo um, 3, I uh, like there to be like different types of Forge World, like um, sand, Sandbox, Sand Trap, whatever it is. Oh, like, Sand, um, trap. sand trap, yeah. That was a beast map. Yeah. So that's what? Like... Different maps? Or maybe yeah, different, you can like, change textures. the terrain? Guys, was that, was that the map with the Hornets on? I can't remember. No, no that, that was... It's got yeah. elephants in it. It was the one with the elephants. I, I, I think elephants are possibly one of the most pointless... Uh, <laughs> in elephants. Halo. They should bring back <laughs> elephants. Oh yeah, that'd be epic. Um, I'm not sure about In matchmaking. Make them completely forgeable. Oh yeah, oh. The forgeable maybe. elephants. Have you ever done like, uh, elephant walls on the map? Or just like... Uh, yes. Have you ever put, um, a hornet in a, a um, elephant? You can fly it up. <laughs> yeah. It's, it's so weird. Anyway, I'll tell you something I would like about Forge in Halo 4 that I really want. Actually, two things yeah. I desperately want in Forge. Yeah. To make me Forge so much more. Which is custom firefight maps. As well. Oh, that would be amazing. I think that would be cool. uh, Being able to spawn your own enemies so you could fight them in, yeah, that's in, my second in your own firefight. Spawning that would be amazing. Yeah, we did, we also did, spawning allies. Yeah, we did kind of cover that make in, I think it was our first or second episode. Yeah, we, we did this Forge episode, so shh. I, 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 I wasn't complaining, I was just saying just reminding people that we had covered it. It's like in um, in Reach, you can have spawn zones, and you can increase the size of it. If you could have something like that, but select like um, grunts or yeah, like grunts. elites. Hey yeah, guys, I've just thought of an amazing idea. Yeah, yeah. If we send yeah. this oh, forge topic to three four three, saying what we want, <laughs> that would be hilarious. Just see if they like on on the release day. Just say uh, a few things have been added. Due to uh, some of the amazing ideas of the uh, past, Team Awesome Source Productions. Yeah. I how I. Oh yeah. dear. Okay. Only a dream away, hey. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Only a whole dream. A whole dream. Right. Yeah. So another thing I'd like to add, which I've actually thought of, by the fact, I think Jack agrees with me on this, which is interactive stuff. The thing that gives me the main idea for this is TNT cannons in Minecraft. I spent <laughs> months oh my of God. my life trying to make a work in reach. No, no, wait. It's no, really no. hard to do, Just but I got it working. It would be it would be really good if you could like create your own cave. Fred can't do them hunt. because for some reason he like he drops the fusion cores in by forge, which makes them respawn where they explode. But you have to make a dispense. You have to make like a thing that makes drops them slowly in, and it's hard, but it's so worth it. 
you get off the room talking. <laughs> oh dear. It's hard but completely worth it. <laughs> oh dear. Okay, Ralph, well, can I talk about a bit about what I want to see in Forge? Yeah, yeah, go ahead. I, so. I want to see a new map. Basically, a new Halo ring. So. Uh, and also, oh, I wish yeah. you could uh, customize the. Uh, you said about making firefight maps. I wish you could kind of customize them as well. Like yeah. pre-made ones. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, and I was um, thinking. I don't know if anybody else has tried um, forging buildings, especially in um, the canyon or, or in Hemorrhage. It's it's all like hilly Grand and bumpy. It's like got like puddles and rocks and stuff all in the wrong places. Yeah, that's right. If yeah. um, 343 added a flat world, just like completely flat, like um, Minecraft, just flat completely Minecraft. flat. No, no Except like without bumps the or, hills or anything. No slimes. Yeah, yeah. no slimes. Um, yeah. You, you could like make big bases and not, not have to worry about lumps of rock and grass and hill bits sticking out of the floor. You can yeah. even like. So that's what you mean, because then you could have actually proper bases, nice firing lines. Or maybe, yeah. maybe even you could have make your own hills. Yeah, like, like add your own scenery, like, like uh, trees and bushes and I grass. I think you should be able to terraform your planet, like change the height and like, the depth yeah, exactly. and stuff. Because yeah. I think. Like the Sims. Point is, though, uh, with Forge, it's awesome. going to be. Maybe it's gonna not be, awesome. It's going to be quite hard to change. Like, I think the firefight thing is going to be quite difficult. Yeah. That yeah. would be. It depends on the. Um, on the engine and depend on, on and on how um, how three four three decide to do it and what map as well because think about it uh, it's quite hard you can't make a map like sword base really can you well not at the oh. moment but if they added a, like texture packs or something like that to my into um, uh, Halo how oh, you almost said Minecraft there didn't you yeah I know I was, <laughs> if you were to say that I would have trolled yeah. But anyway, so, yeah, well, you would have trolled. On, on like a desert map, <laughs> you could have different coloured blocks for like um for the desert. Yeah, you could have desert barricades, whatever. Yeah, desert themed barricades, like, like, like sand stuck to the walls and stuff. Yeah, that would actually be amazing. I thought another thing they really could add is that structures on more maps, because in yeah. Reach it was what yeah, yeah, Forge yeah. World Tempest could have structures on. Yeah. yeah, and that was pointless. And Jack, and I don't think you have the noble map pack, I know Will does, and I do. I have both. But, um, mm -hmm. I have you might not have Tempest. Yeah, I have both as well. I have Up yours. Do you have the anniversary <laughs> map pack? Okay, okay guys, stop yes, arguing. Yes, I do have the anniversary map pack. Okay. Yes, yeah, so Ooh. we should stop bitching. This is where I say, come at me bro. But... We aren't dogs. <laughs> come at me bro. <laughs> come at me, that's such a hilarious picture. <laughs> I'll put that on. I hope... Jack, have you seen it? Yeah, okay. Picture. Okay, calm you down. Have a very oh. fun okay, right. Well, has anybody else Calm to, down. to say about Forge? Anybody? No, I, no, think, I think we've pretty much wrapped everything up. Wrapped it up like a kebab. Or well, pot noodles. Or well, pot noodles. Oh, great, not pot noodles. <laughs> 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 yeah. So, should we bring this stuff to a close then? Yeah, well, guys, thank yeah, you for okay. watching the very drastic fifth episode of Halo 4 DNR huh. Discussion and Rumors, yeah. episode 5. That's gonna hard. And, guys. Sam, you have to say a bit about it. Um, well, I would just like to say that you should, if you like this video, then please do like the video. If you have a comment, any of the stuff we said, comment down below or subscribe above if you really liked it. And now I have to go and watch Pocoyo for my Spanish homework. Goodbye. <laughs> okay, well, people, first of all, just imagine how awkward it'd be, it would be if someone said, uh, press the subscribe button below and uh, comment above. Okay. Fail. Anyway, well, guys, well, let, we'll see you next episode, guys. And again, I'm sorry it's uploaded late. And Robin, again, won't be doing any more videos because he's had everything taken away. Yeah, yeah. See you guys. See you guys.